Westchester firefighters, police, and the Butler County Bomb Squad rushed to this Walgreens parking lot just before noon today. At the center of the investigation, this white van parked in the lot. Originally what happened, a subject came into the police department building and the fr our front lobby is the court lobby and was acting a uh, little, little out of the ordinary. That man reportedly told police there was a bomb inside the rental van and originally said it was parked at AstraZeneca. Tower 73 respond to AstraZeneca. Subject on station at the police department advising he put a device in a white transit van on the property there. He stated here at the PDs in the lobby that it's set to go off in two hours. And then he later retracted that statement to say it was parked here. In the parking lot of the Walgreens at 747 and Union Center. The drugstore was evacuated, along with other businesses in the area. Roads were also shut down. So this is a huge impact to the commerce of, of not just Westchester, the surrounding tri-state. Um, 747 be a major you know, state route and all the truck traffic and commerce that's going through. In the meantime, Gort, the bomb squad's robot went to work. And a robot went to the vehicle and uh, had a camera to look inside and they determined there was uh, something that did not look right and they wanted to get a closer look. A closer look determined it was just a phone cable. No bomb was found. In the last update that I got from the Westchester Police Department, they were still questioning the man. No charges have been filed. Reporting live tonight in Westchester, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5. Karen, do we know if the guy being questioned is the person who rented that van? You know, that is the question I asked Police Chief Joel Herzog, but he would not comment on that. Also, one other thing that we want to know is, did, does this man have any sort of connection to Walgreens or AstraZeneca? But police aren't commenting on that either. All Back right, Karen Johnson, live for us tonight in Westchester. Thanks so much.